Hey, what's up, guys? Um, just by watching uh, Charlie Brenneman and a couple other people, I decided to maybe do a blog leading up to my fight. Um, today's Sunday, um, so I'm about six days out from the fight, five days out from weigh-ins. Um, today, basically, a rundown of my day was woke up, took a spin class with my sauna suit on to try to burn a couple pounds, um, did some uh, training at NJ uh, MMA with a couple of my training partners. It was my last real hard session before the fight. Um, after that, just did family stuff, and like I said, just had my last nice meal. And I'll be back at it tomorrow morning. Gonna wake up real early, do some cardio, go to work, and then after that, do some jiu-jitsu, no-gi jiu-jitsu, and some kickboxing. Um, I'm starting to taper the training down just because I have a few bumps and bruises um, that I need to heal up before um, Saturday. But I'm feeling good, my weight's right on pace, and um, I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. I'll keep you guys posted. Guys, uh, just got out of the gym. It's about 5.45. Got to cut a few pounds. I'm driving to work now. Not the funnest thing in the world, but it's a necessary evil. Hopefully don't hit too much traffic. Um, I'll keep you guys posted with uh, some training footage tonight. I'm going to do some jiu-jitsu and then some... Um, some kickboxing. Um, till then, talk to you later. Hey, what's up, guys? It's about seven o'clock. I uh, straight from work, coming to train. Um, real, real, real martial arts. Um, it's actually gi class right now, but I got a couple training partners coming in to work with me, no gi, uh, just to get a little bit of work. Nothing crazy, because like I said, I'm kind of bringing down the training a little bit. But I am going to work with sweat and do some. Uh, technical training. So uh, let's walk in and see what they're doing. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 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 one, two, three, Mikey Main. four, five, six, six seven, seven, eight, eight nine, nine, ten. Get so, uh, it up, ready, one. Guys, I'll keep you tuned as to what's going on and uh, talk to you next time. Ready. What's up guys, I uh, just did a little bit of um, healthy training, nothing too crazy, I'm trying to bring it down like I said, um, now I'm going to do some pad work with the man, Reggie Good. Um, after that, I'm going to go home, eat a light meal, and relax some more. Uh, I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Thanks. Uh, good morning, everyone. It is Tuesday, 4.45. Uh, coming in before work just to get like a quick half hour um, cardio in burn a couple pounds. I'm pretty much on pace with my weight. I'm actually a little uh, lighter than I want to be, but you know what? It'll probably just save me a little bit of time and energy the day of the cut. So, um, World Gym in Rockaway. As you can see, I'm not the only psycho here at 445. Um, but, um, so like I said, just trying to get a workout in. Head to work. So, uh, talk to you guys later. What's up, guys? Just left the gym. On my way to work, sitting in awful traffic. I hate New York City commuting, as you can see. I'm actually moving now, but uh, for about 45 minutes I wasn't. Um, anyway, just letting you know, feeling good. Pretty hydrated, believe it or not. Um, weight's good, workout's good. Time to get a good day's work in. And then after that, put some more training in. Have a good day, guys. So it's uh, Tuesday, around 5 o'clock, over at uh, Edge, Hoboken, uh, get some wrestling in, uh, with Mr. Jeff March, Marsh, sorry, and uh, that's about it, keep you guys posted. What's up guys, uh, it's been like two days since I've uh, made a video, I hasn't really been doing anything, just cutting weight, not really training, working, uh, Gad and I. Woke up early this morning, 
I cut a couple more pounds, and we're driving down to AC. Uh, just have kind of like a story for you guys. We're driving down. All of a sudden, this car drifts. Three lanes of traffic. Bangs into the median wall. And uh, the result is that. We pull out this kind sir from his car. Patrick. Kind of fell asleep at the wheel, you know. Um, we're going to wait for the police to get here and then uh, continue on our voyage down to AC. We'll keep you posted with the rest of the weight cut, weigh-ins, and uh, that's pretty much it. Talk to you later, guys. Hey, guys. Now we're going to sit in on the photo shoot for Claudio. So we'll bring you over to him right now. All right. Got the man getting right away, man. Got the girls laying in next. Get ready to get down. Our first fight tonight, Brian Kelleher versus Claudio Ledesma. First to the stage will be Brian Kelleher out of Long Island, New York. All right, so this is pretty much what we do after weigh-in and after the first meal. Yes, the first meal of the evening and about four Gatorades later. This is uh, your future Bellator winner. Um, we had a little bit crazy of a weigh-in. We had a whole crazy day. Six o'clock, we were driving, saving lives. We uh, will show you guys the, the videotapes earlier. Pulling old man Patrick out of a car on a Garden State Parkway. Weigh-ins. Our guy didn't make weight. He was about four pounds over. So, um, you know, me being the master negotiator, we got the fight pulled off still at a catch weight. Got uh, Claudia a little extra change in the pocket. And uh, now we're just resting up and trying to put the weight back on the skinny man. So uh, we'll see you guys. Yeah, he's not that skinny. So we'll see you guys soon, and uh, we'll keep you posted on everything that's going on. And uh, we got a pretty nice setup, though. Flat screen, got a nice view. Can't really see. It's dark out. And uh, we got a couple of nice beds and stuff like that. So Bally's is treating us nice with the rooms, and uh, we'll get back to you guys a little bit later. All right? See you later, guys. What's up guys, so the coolest part of my day has come up, I get to have uh, dinner, post way and dinner with my family at Carmine's, uh, everybody say hi, 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 so um, tomorrow's, tomorrow's the big day, so um, after this just gonna go take it down, eat, probably some more, um, rest, wake up whatever time I want, and then just relax, so uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow, fight day! What's up? It's fight day. Uh, woke up, had a little breakfast. It's about 
12 o'clock, just kind of hanging out in the room, relaxing. I don't like to do much, just kind of hang out. I'm going to have a little bit of lunch with the fam and with Miss Kay. Miss Kay's my secret weapon. I'm not going to tell you why she's here. Uh, um, so what's up, Jay? Yeah. And uh, that's it. We'll get back to you when we start uh, reporting in. We have to report in by 5 o'clock. You guys will get some footage of that, all right? Later. Walking in the hallway here, getting ready for Claudio's warm up for his Bellator debut, 135. I got sneakers. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. All right, we're in Claudio Ledesma's room, pre-fight Bellator. Uh, getting his hands wrapped by the master Reggie Good over there. Got Grandmaster Garrett Goldsberry over here, my man. Oh great, there's an inspector here. <laughs> All right, we got the wrestling coach over here, Jeff Marsh from Hoboken, helping Claudio get ready for the fight. And uh, and me, Professor George Cernak from Team Henzo Grace in Denville. Looking forward to a great night of fights tonight and a big win. Desma here. It's all over. I'm taking my lonely walk back to my room. I kind of like to do this after every fight to think and thank everybody. Um, I want to thank everybody who was a part of this win for me. My training partners, my fucking trainers, everybody, man. I, it's too many people to name and I don't want to hurt any feelings. But I don't name any feelings, but you guys know I love you guys and I really appreciate everything you did for me. I'm nobody without you guys. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed the journey, enjoyed the fight, and uh, Maybe see you guys on the next one, all right? Thank you.